Hello my beautiful souls, this is Moonseeker of Light Guardian and today I'm doing an unspoken words reading. This will be a conversation with a Divine Masculine. So let's see what the Divine Masculine wants to open this up with. This is a general reading. Please take what resonates, leave the rest. If it doesn't fit, it doesn't fit. That doesn't mean you should force it. Uh, if it doesn't resonate, it's not for you and that's okay. I made you breakfast. So... What the Divine Masculine wants to talk about here is that, you know, he wants to be the person that gets to make you breakfast in the morning. The person that gets to wake up with you every morning and have that opportunity to surprise you in the morning and say, I made you breakfast. I cherish you. I am infatuated with you. So they not only hold you dear in their heart they cherish you they're also infatuated by you by your energy by your body by your smile by your brain by your inner and outer beauty they are totally infatuated and they have this you know you know when you have that crush on someone and especially like when you're younger you were in school or whatever you had this crush and it was like all you could think about i feel like with that with that cherish you i feel like they have that that kind of um feelings for you um but it doesn't like it hasn't worn off it's always been there but now they kind of are in a place where they they're feeling all these things but they can't express it they can't express themselves because they hold their cards close to the chest they don't really know how to verbalize the words the words come out or mumbled when they try to speak it goes through like their head and by the time it gets to you it's just mumbo jumbo and it comes out wrong and it instead hurts you instead of telling you how they truly feel so those are the opening messages so let's have a look at what's going on in the divine masculine's heart heart messages what does he want to say from the bottom of his heart i am better now um there's been a uh, collect there's been a collective of divine masculines that have been really doing the work they were the ones that a few months ago were coming through as unlovable they didn't see themselves as, lo as lovable so now they've been doing a lot of work and they're getting to the place where they're a lot better they're in their heart space and they're doing so much better now and getting to a point perhaps where they can start expressing themselves truly and authentically we have i never did tell you but i always thought you looked beautiful they may have been men and women of a few words but they always did appreciate everything you did uh, they always did appreciate when you made an effort when it came to your outer beauty they never did tell you but they always appreciated it they're now ready to step into the sunshine into their happiness into their own self-love into what their heart is calling them to do when it comes to this connection they think about you all the time this is because they're ready they're ready now they just need to figure out the steps to actually do it and we have here i was broken look at this rounding up we started with i am better and i was broken and just as i mentioned before they were not in a place where they felt lovable they were in a place where they were broken and they're saying you know all that whatever they did is because they were broken but they're better now so that's where they're they are in their heart space what the divine masculine is saying here is that there are things that he or she wants to say to you the things that they want to bring to the table and they can do that now because they're better because they're ready to step into the sunshine and you are the person that's on their mind constantly so what else do we have here what do you want to talk about divine master you are an angel i feel badly for the way i treated you you didn't deserve that would you reject me and i can't handle your words right now so they are ready to step into the sunshine now they are acknowledging that you are someone who has been an angel to them in you know sent from the angels you are an earth angel perhaps uh you could be a light worker you could be a 
a uh, you know psychic clairvoyant anything you can be very intuitive but you could also you don't you don't have to be um but you're an angel to them you're someone who came and turned their word around you brought healing to them and they feel badly for the way they treated you because when they were broken they didn't know better and when they bro were broken all they could do was bring their brokenness to you as well which in turn perhaps broke you or just hurt you so now they're you know they're asking would you reject them because of the way they treated you if they could came back would you reject them and that's why they can't handle your words right now because they think your words are going to be harsh and you have every right to be harsh. Um, but if they are, they've gotten to that place where they are ready to uh, step into the sunshine, but they're not ready to handle your words right now. They could, uh, your, your words right now could perhaps uh, set them back. They're not fully transform to where they where they need to be in order to handle your words handle your words uh, authentically as in allowing you to speak your truth the way you you uh, felt when this happened the way you you perceived things speaking your truth and for them to stand and listen and hear your truth and acknowledge your truth they're not quite they're not, not they're not quite there yet they're working on it and they will get there. I'm, I'm getting the energy that this this collective of DMs, you will get there. You just have a little bit more work to do to get to the place where you are secure in yourself. You're authentic within yourself. And this, once you are that, the words are not going to um, bother you the same way they did when you were listening to those words in a place of pride and ego. I hope that makes sense. So guys, that was today's reading. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, share if you feel so inclined. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.